Oh, it's the game of the year right now in the Pac-12 Conference. You got the USC Trojans ranked in the college football playoff ranks. And of course, UW number four in the country right now in Seattle. This one's going to be electric. I can't wait to see how the Trojans respond to UW's front seven. And it's not just the way they play, right? You see Vita Vea, Azim Victor, Keyshawn Villaria. That front seven with the loss of Joe Mathis are still vicious. How is SC going to respond in game when they feel that type of energy, that enthusiasm? And oh, by the way, the crowd in Seattle going to be going off. And the way you offset that from Clay Helton's perspective, he says it's a big man's game. They got to win with the big guys up front and run the rock. They've done well the last few weeks on the ground. 270 yards rushing against Oregon, almost 400 versus caliber, 300 versus Arizona. Can this offensive line do what they've done to lesser opponents against the UW defensive front? Keep an eye on that. Now, how do you slow down this UW electric offensive attack? Well, I think Porter Gustin, he's got to absolutely go off and be a game wrecker against this UW offensive line. If there is a kink, it's that. And I think USC is going to change up the looks. They're going to bring different pressure. You see Quinton Powell giving different pressure off the edge. Marvell tell the safety, all of a sudden him making big plays trying to get picks and disrupt the timing of Jake Browning, but it's not easy because they got the most dynamic wideout in America. And it's not just because John Ross is fast. He's become a technician the last few weeks as a route runner, understanding how to set up safety. So they're going to try to put one safety on John Ross when he's in the slot lookout. It's going to be big play all day for UW. This one's going to be a blast. Big time implications for the college football playoff and of course the Pac-12 South title that is still up for grabs. 4.30 on Fox. It's going to be a blast. UW, SC, get ready for this one.